Yo, so you're probably here because you want to make some money in factions. And I know it can be kind of difficult to start, but once you get started, it goes so fast. So here today, guys, I'm here to tell you how to make money in factions. And um, I'm going to be playing here on my server. But this works for almost any server. It really just depends on your server's economy. So make sure if you go, if you have this kind of shop or you have a different kind of shop, the first place that you're going to want to start is at the shop because you need to know what farming materials sell for the most money so let's say uh on, i know on this server it's mostly sugarcane so 16 sugarcane sells for 288 dollars and then cactus is the next and it sells 16 for 50 and both of these can be made into auto farms the sugarcane can also be a regular farm but it can also be made into an auto farm which is what i'm going to be showing you guys here um so basically let's go to this is my farm area so basically let's, let's do this this is how you make money so i've made i went here and i've made this uh big cactus farm it's not as big as i want it i want to get it higher but i'm going to show you guys how to make this real quick so that you can be making money with cactus um i need my supplies here so we're gonna grab just a little bit of that and a little bit of that and i need a little bit of this good stuff you're gonna these are the supplies that you're gonna need for it you're gonna need cactus sand and string so if you go up here let me go up here this is how you're gonna start your farm here so you have a cactus placed down and the way that you have this so it can be the most you want it to be the most compact that it can possibly be because if you have it compact then it will produce a lot more so basically how you do this is you're going to take your string you're going to place it right next to the cactus and it will be floating in the in between each sand and everything and then all you're going to have to do is place sand on top of that and that sand will cause this cactus to break and uh, it'll fall down into the water uh, you just keep doing that all the way through it, it's time consuming guys but it is worth it um, and you can just keep doing that all the way across and up as high as you want you can make this as long as you want it doesn't really matter your dimension um, and then the collection system uh, depends on how your server runs because on this server we do have crop hoppers which is basically it just auto collects anything that's broken in the chunk but I don't have one of those right now so basically I just have a water system set up to where it falls it goes in this is how you buffer the water so that it, it still goes through it's on ice so it goes quickly through there into this water goes down here and into a hopper which goes into a chest system and um, that's basically how you're gonna make money from cactus alright guys so that's basically how you're gonna start your cactus farm um, you just want to do that up a lot and all you have to do is afk and this will automatically go into your chest system and uh, make you a ton of money really fast um, the next step guys or the next farm not the next step that you can have is the auto sugarcane farm so I have two little models here um, but this one I prefer this one because it works all 100% of the time um, the reason this one is iffy is because depending on the ticks on your server see how this sand isn't there should be a sand there like that one but it disappeared for some reason meaning you have to like reset the whole system but it does make you a ton of money guys um, I will just link videos in the description to these cac this cactus farm at least I don't know about that one I'll try to find a video for that one but I'll find uh, auto cactus farm videos and I will, or auto sugarcane farm and uh, it just puts stuff into the hoppers it just comes in the water same as the cactus farm it goes into the hoppers and it makes you a ton of money uh, very fast and this one also it just goes if the pistons push it it falls in and it goes into these chests down here and it makes you a ton of money really fast guys so that's how you're gonna start with your farmables and then the next thing that I'm going to show you is spawners so if we go to slash home B we have our blaze spawners this is probably your first step um, in factions because blaze usually are the first spawner that you're gonna want to get unless your server does like ranking like psycho PvP or something um, where they do like levels and you have to be a certain level to get spawners but blaze spawners are pretty good uh, they spawn typically faction servers have it in stacks so basically you want to uh, to just kill the blazes off and then sell the blaze rods which typically sell for a pretty good amount of money and then once you have enough money guys IGs is your next step from blaze so basically once you have IGs you're gonna make a farm for those I will link in the description how to make a blaze farm and also uh, that's just gonna make you a the, the iron golem farm is the last step in factions on how to make money because it just auto produces iron which always sells for a lot and it will make you a ton of money guys um, another way that you guys could possibly make money is raiding um, I don't have any like 
I don't have any things of rating or any like examples of rating. Um, but basically raiding is you get into someone's base and steal their stuff steal their spawners steal all their stuff and it's it's just a fun time honestly and it's great but that's another way you can make money and guys that's probably gonna do it um, it really just depends on your faction server on how you can make money you just need to research your economy figure out what's going to work for you and that will be the way that you're gonna make a ton of money on factions guys so I hope you did enjoy please be sure to hit that subscribe button for more and I will see you all next time peace out